Welcome to the District 3 Virtual Watch Party for the Medallion Awards and Awards of Excellence. I'm Jeff Julian, District 3 Director, Chief of Staff at Harper College in Palatine, Illinois, and your host for today's festivities, which are emanating live from my kitchen. That's right. Now, normally we would be in person together. We were going to be in Grand Rapids this year, but we've had to adapt just like you have at your colleges and go to a virtual awards ceremony. But we're going to have a lot of fun today celebrating all of your great work. We had over 300 entries for the medallions, and I can't wait to reveal the bronze, silver, and gold award winners, along with the communicator of the year, the pace setter of the year, and the rising star of the year. It is going to be so much fun. So thanks for being with us today. We really, really appreciate it. We know this has been a difficult year to be a marketing and public relations professional at community colleges, but you've all done excellent work, risen to the occasion, and it's shown in this year's awards. So congratulations. Now, before we get to the awards, I want to turn it over to NCNPR President Juan Gutierrez. Hello. I'm Juan Gutierrez, Director of Marketing and Public Relations at Orange Coast College and this year's NCMPR President. This global pandemic continues to keep us at a distance, and of course we wish we could be together to celebrate in person. Unfortunately, that's not possible, and so your District Director and District Executive Council have assembled this virtual presentation to honor the great work that you do. I'm happy to be able to say a few introductory words. On behalf of the board and staff of NCMPR, I want to extend our sincere congratulations to those being honored today. Some of you are taking home gold, silver, or bronze medallion awards for demonstrating the very best in design and communication at two-year colleges within your region. And a select group of you are being honored as a pace setter, communicator, or rising star for your extraordinary contributions to community college marketing and PR. To each of you, congratulations on this recognition that is so well deserved. And to everyone who's listening, whether you're receiving an award or not, you're all winners in our minds. Yes, they may sound cliche, but it's true. Thanks for the important work you do to support the mission of Community College and to tell our story each and every day. Let me quickly mention that we hope you'll join me and my colleagues from across the country for our national conference, which will be held, yes, virtually, next March. We'll have more details coming soon, and we look forward to bringing you a virtual experience that is informative and engaging. Our theme, appropriately, is ever-changing, everlasting. It certainly rings true in today's ever-changing landscape of community college communications, where our everyday challenge is to leave a lasting impression on students and constituents. I look forward to connecting with you in March. Again, congratulations on your achievements and keep up the good work. As always, we hope you'll stay connected with NCMPR and please let us know how we can support you in the important work that you do. Thank you, Juan, for those words of encouragement. I can say as a district director, I really appreciate the support that the national office at NCMPR provides all of the districts. It is greatly appreciated, so thank you. I also want to thank the District 3 Executive Council. These members support the activities of District 3 all throughout the year, and without them, we wouldn't be able to have a virtual awards ceremony or some of the other great things that we do throughout the year. So let me recognize Christina Henskin, the Assistant Director of District 3, John Meineke, the Illinois State Rep, Barb Drager, the Wisconsin Rep, Ellie Bainbridge, the Michigan Rep, Kimmy Labarge, the Indiana Rep, Jessica Huffman, the Ohio Rep, and of course, Stacy Cartnell, who is our Medallions Coordinator for this year. Stacy did an outstanding job of organizing all of the activities. And I also want to thank our judges who volunteered their time to help determine the winners of the Medallion Awards. So thank you to everyone. Organizations like NCMPR can't run well without volunteers like you. So I really encourage you to take advantage of the opportunities to get involved with NCMPR, both at the district and national level. Whether you write for the council publication, present a webinar, or do a presentation at a conference, we need your support, so please, stay involved. We really, really appreciate it. And now, without further ado, let's get to those Medallion Awards winners. And now, the 2020 Medallion Awards. Print, Academic Catalog, or Class Schedule. The bronze goes to Washtenaw Community College. The silver goes to Heartland Community College. 
and the gold goes to Milwaukee Area Technical College for the 2020-21 catalog, Your Guide to Milwaukee Area Technical College. Judges said, love the use of photos, icons, and white space throughout the entire catalog. Beautiful work. Such an easy document to navigate with loads of information. Viewbook. The bronze goes to Waukesha County Technical College. The silver goes to Southeastern Illinois College. And the gold goes to North Central Michigan College for the view book Endless Possibilities. Judges said, great use of student and faculty spotlights throughout. Some humor infused gives the view book a playful edge. Beautiful imagery draws the reader in. The information included on local activities allows a potential student to see the full picture of being a student. Well done. Annual report. The bronze goes to Moraine Valley Community College. The silver goes to Joliet Junior College. And the gold goes to Grand Rapids Community College for the GRCC Foundation Annual Report. Judges said, beautiful design and well-written. Nice prioritization of information and clear communication through images and text. Great layout. Newsletter. The bronze goes to Moraine Park Technical College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for the Impact Magazine, November 2019. Great use of images, very bright, fun and inviting colors that complement each other, engaging stories, great work. Magazine. The bronze goes to Cuyahoga Community College. The silver goes to Harper College. And the gold goes to Cuyahoga Community College for the Tri-C Times Summer 2020. The judges said, impressive use of a of graphics to illustrate students and programs. This magazine has a clean design while infusing fun and engaging graphics and imagery to keep the reader moving along. Many engaging student and graduate profiles throughout. Very well done. Brochure, single or series. The bronze goes to Harper College. The silver goes to Joliet Junior College. And the gold goes to Milwaukee Area Technical College for building the workforce. Judges said, really nice brochure, good layout, and graphics to help organize information so that it's easy to understand. Good use of photos and branding. Book or specialty publication. The bronze goes to Jackson College. The silver goes to Moraine Valley Community College. And the gold goes to Oakton Community College for the 2020 commencement program. Judges said, a lovely keepsake. The photo collage and bite-sized pieces of narrative content were thoughtful and clear. Flyer, single or series. The bronze goes to North Iowa Area Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Milwaukee Area Technical College for its Fast Facts brochure. Postcard, single or series. The bronze goes to Blackhawk Technical College. The silver goes to Grand Rapids Community College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for its Writer Center Coffee House Postcard Fall 2019. The judges said simply, love this. Note cards or invitations. The bronze goes to Mor Monroe County Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Harper College for the congratulatory card for graduates. Judges said, what a wonderful way to stay in touch and grow your alumni base. Love the image on the front of the card. Poster, single, or series. The bronze goes to Elgin Community College. The silver goes to Grand Rapids Community College. And the gold goes to Kellogg Community College for its Black History Month series. Judges said these are just beautiful designs. 
I love the concept of featuring today's black youth coupled with a historical figure. It really helps bring black history to the forefront and highlights its relevance today. Digital or electronic media. Electronic catalog, schedule, view book, or annual report. The bronze goes to Lakeland Community College. The silver goes to Oakland Community College. And the gold goes to North Central Michigan College for its 2018-2019 annual report. Judges said the images are very appealing. Electronic newsletter. The bronze goes to Monroe County Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for Spartan Review issue number 208. Judges said, I remember the uncertainty in May, and this would have been a great newsletter to read during that time. I bet the employees found the information helpful and uplifting. Good job on promoting a hashtag and encouraging employees to share their stories. E-card. The bronze goes to Lorraine County Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Lorraine County Community College for its welcome to fall semester. The judges said among all the to-dos a student must go through to start classes, it was nice to see a timely message that was uplifting, inspiring, and welcoming. I appreciated that in addition to the email, the welcome video was also a part of the welcome landing page where students could come across it as they're getting familiar with campus and the resources available. Nice execution on the video and making the message focused on the students. Website. The bronze goes to Monroe County Community College. The silver goes to Washtenaw Community College. And there was no gold awarded in the website category. Microsite. The bronze goes to Monroe County Community College. The silver goes to Kellogg Community College. And the gold goes to Moraine Valley Community College for its 2020 virtual graduation microsite. Judges said pretty strong website that meets the goals and objectives. It has all the components of convocation for the various audiences. Social media. The bronze goes to Grand Rapids Community College. The silver goes to Lorraine County Community College. And the gold goes to College of Lake County for its Instagram page. Judges said very strong Instagram page, consistent fresh imagery, nice use of Instagram highlights and graphics, strong engagement, well done. Video, video long form. The bronze goes to Zane State College. The silver goes to Grand Rapids Community College. And the gold goes to Lorraine County Community College for its dedicated to the class of 2020 video. When you found us at Lorraine County Community College, you arrived with your own reality and your own reasons for chasing the dream of a diploma. Some of you came to be an example for your family on how important education is. Others came to train for a skill you were not only passionate about, but one that would lead to a job and a career. You came to us in generations with youthful smiles and wisdom in your eyes. And with those eyes, it helped your mind realize you searched for a light, a spark, you yearned for a place to call home and a support system to surround you with care at every turn. Because there were turns, marked in some cases by a simple sign that meant one thing on one day and held a completely different meaning the next. But you know that, don't you? For the class of 2020, words like COVID and Corona and closed became part of the lesson too, part of the journey. Another hurdle. The history books that future students will one day study will speak of this time, your time. And in its reflective narrative, it will point to people like you today who lived it, who discovered in their own uncertainty 
that there is one certainty, and it's spirit. Your spirit to overcome. Your spirit to find your voice. To remember why you came in the first place, and to teach yourself your own lesson in strength. For it is that strength that delivers you here today to your degree, your cap, and your gown. Your time at Lorain County Community College will forever be remembered as the graduating class who persevered. And for all of us wrapped up in our own little world, we have an opportunity to remind ourselves of the importance of our own humanity of the gifts that each of us bring to bear and how we can unite even when we're apart. So graduates, let your resiliency and your ability to adapt drive you forward and we'll watch and we'll smile and we'll forever be proud. Proud that you're one of us, Lorain County Community College. Judges said, you nailed it. Absolutely perfect. If I could score this 1,000, I would. Whoever wrote the narrative, thank you. You captured the essential essence of what we have all endured with COVID-19 and especially our students. Well done. Video shorts, single. The bronze goes to Elgin Community College. The silver goes to Moraine Valley Community College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for its What Is ECC Really Like? What I like most about ECC is the community. It has become my second shot at um, college. Just a nice environment, you know, a nice school, nice teachers, nice people. I feel like I'm going to be more successful because of how welcoming everyone has been. I um, really like the flexibility with all of my, my classes and everything, and I really like all like the support I get from my teachers. You meet great people all around here, this campus, and the professors are great. They have years under their belt, so they know what they're doing. I feel like a lot of my friends and everyone else have issues when they're at bigger schools, but ECC kind of attends to each student individually and really focus on their needs and helps them succeed. I did all my prereqs and I got everything done and completed and I don't have like stress about transferring so I feel like super confident when I go to like the school I want to go to that I have everything in order. I am very proud of my education here at ECC. It's taken me uh, into better places and it's helped me a lot not just you know academically but in my own personal life. Judges said, loved this video. Fantastic look and feel. I really enjoyed the content and the quotes looked amazing to drive home the storytelling and awesome testimonials. Video shorts, series. The bronze goes to Harper College. The silver goes to Southeastern Illinois College. And the gold goes to College of Lake County for its CLC, this is EMPS. For me, it's about being self-sufficient, not relying on anyone else. Designing is an art to me. Being behind the wheel is everything to me. There's just something about the energy inside a garage. We get to design, to build, to assemble. Simply so I don't have to pay someone else to do it. Racing is my life. I want to be the best in the industry. I'll be able to grow my company the way I want to grow it. I want to inspire those watching me. It's my passion, my hobby. I just love it. I have an entire team that depends on me, so I need to be my best. I just love figuring out new tools new equipment, new software. I need to figure out how we can be a step ahead out on the track so I can engineer the cars we'll be driving in 50 years. The shop here has anything you could ever need. I grew up watching races. Now it's my turn. I want to play my part with those around me. I'm here to learn how to put my ideas into practice. It's all about my success on the track. Why am I here? Because this is me. Because this is me. Because this is me. Because this is me. Judges said, very strong series of videos. A lot of work went into these, and I like the somber tone in the videos. A wise choice instead of going with more generic, smiling students. Great series that focuses on storytelling. Photography and illustration. 
Original photography unmanipulated. The bronze goes to Elgin Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Cuyahoga Community College for Tim and friends. Judges said great photo and composition really tells the story of a moment in time. Love the kid looking on right between the two subjects really draws you in. Original photography manipulated. The bronze goes to Moraine Valley Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for ECC Cybersecurity. Judges said very clever use of imagery, subtle manipulation, technology, and lighting to create the overall photo composition, including a manipulated image projected into the background of the photo adds an extra layer of depth and originality that creates visual interest. Great work. Logo design. Bronze goes to Elgin Community College. Silver goes to College of Lake County. And the gold goes to Heartland Community College for HCC Esports logo. Judges said really sharp logo, looks modern, professional, and has a coolness factor that should fit in well with the esports crowd. Very powerfully done. Computer generated illustration. The bronze goes to Kellogg Community College. The silver goes to Cuyahoga Community College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for Welcome Weeks Spring 2020. Judges said, I really like this as a whole. The design is tight and the top element really draws in the viewer, going from the general to the specific in the text below. Nice job. Advertising. Print advertisement. The bronze goes to Elgin Community College. The silver goes to College of Lake County. And the gold goes to Monroe County Community College for its Congratulations Graduates ad. Judges said, great job. I love that you included the grad photos, making the most of the situation this year and giving your grads a shout out. Radio advertisement, single or series. The bronze goes to Grand Rapids Community College. The silver goes to Monroe County Community College. And the gold goes to Monroe County Community College for its high demand, high wage careers radio series. There comes a point in all our lives when we have to ask ourselves, do I want a job? Usually a series of jobs. Or do I want a career? If it's the latter, you might want to consider business. Right now, accountants, accounting assistants, financial managers, sales execs, and supply chain managers are in high demand all over Michigan. A degree from Monroe County Community College is a great way to get started. Just go to MonroeHighDemand.com. That's MonroeHighDemand.com. Judges said good message, nice campaign, highlighting jobs that are in demand. TV video advertisement, single or series. The bronze goes to Lorain County Community College. The silver goes to Parkland College. And the gold goes to Harper College for the Harper College TV commercials. Judges said great use of stills in a time when capturing video is difficult. The videos are short and get right to the point. Love the mix of students and the fast paced movement of the video. Novelty advertising. The bronze goes to Grand Rapids Community College. The silver goes to Lorain County Community College. And the gold goes to Lorain County Community College for the AR enhanced Levy campaign placemat. Judges said, I love the innovation and implementation behind this idea. What a great team you have at your college. Digital ad. The bronze goes to Elgin Community College. The silver goes to Grand Rapids Community College. And the gold goes to Black Hawk College for the BHC I Only Pick the Best. 
Judges said this certainly brought a surprise smile to my face. Very gutsy and bold to go with this direction. This ad really grabs your attention. Outdoor media, single or series. The bronze goes to Lincoln Land Community College. The silver goes to Joliet Junior College. And the gold goes to Jackson College for the online learning You've Got This campaign. Judges said solid pieces with a sharp design, text that is relevant and easy to read from far away, and a super simple call to action. Well done. Interior signage or displays, single or series. The bronze goes to North Iowa Area Community College. The silver goes to Lewis and Clark Community College. And the gold goes to Jackson College for its Your Library, We Are More Than Just Books. Judges said, what a stupendous result. Well done on teaching your students that there's more to a library than books. Campaigns. Communication success story or crisis communication. The bronze goes to Fox Valley Technical College. The silver goes to Blackhawk Technical College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for keeping you informed COVID-19 communications. Judges said, amazing work keeping the college community informed during an ever-evolving situation. The video is truly inspirational and the script and momentum made me want to watch more. Wonderful work. Government relations or community relations. The bronze goes to Fox Valley Technical College. The silver goes to Lorain County Community College. And the gold goes to Kellogg Community College. Blaze goes to the RMTC. Judges said, this is fun. This is a fun, creative idea. What a sweet campaign. Very creative way to reach a younger audience. Special event or fundraising. The bronze goes to Cuyahoga Community College. The silver goes to Joliet Junior College. And the gold goes to Kellogg Community College, Bruin Blast 19 and Civic Engagement Fair. Successful recruitment or marketing program. The bronze goes to Kellogg Community College. The silver goes to Kellogg Community College. And the gold goes to Moraine Park Technical College for its I Can campaign. Judges said, well done. This campaign connects well with prospective students and also showcases diversity across your student body. Excellent campaign, well designed and crafted. Social media or online marketing campaign. The bronze goes to Elgin Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Lorain County Community College for its celebrating our graduates. Judges said, amazing. This is all so well thought out and executed. I hope your graduates really connected with it and felt great. Many moving parts here, but it looks like you pulled it off well. Miscellaneous. Excellence in writing. The bronze goes to Cuyahoga Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Elgin Community College for the important message from ECC President Dr. David Som. Judges said, this was very well written, and I respect how vulnerable Dr. Som was in his writing. This provided insight on how the college is responding and resources available and clearly hit the mark for their target audiences. Wildcard. The bronze goes to Heartland Community College. The silver goes to Elgin Community College. And the gold goes to Lorain County Community College for the public art display honoring LCCC graduates. Judges said, creative, impressive, and inspiring. What a unique and beautiful way to acknowledge and celebrate all of the graduates while involving the community in a safe way. Bravo. The public art and lawn art is a creative way to honor graduates during these unusual times. I love the design, the idea, and the ingenuity. Wow, that is truly impressive work. Congratulations to all of our medallion award winners. Excellent work. 
And now it's time to announce the Awards of Excellence for District 3. The Awards of Excellence program recognizes excellence among two-year college communicators and is one of many ways NCMPR supports the professional development of its members. District winners are eligible for the national awards, which will be announced at the virtual conference in March. The Communicator of the Year for District 3 is Dr. Andrea Leibacher, Director of Marketing at Oakton Community College in Illinois. Dr. Andrea Leibacher is a seasoned community college marketing and enrollment professional and has more than 20 years of experience in higher education. She is known as a strong leader who understands the importance of her role as a connector, collaborator, and expert in marketing the college. Dr. Lehmacher has experience across higher education, ranging from admissions and recruitment to leadership positions in marketing strategy and operation. She has shared her knowledge and expertise throughout her career, presenting at conferences, volunteering for committees, and contributing innovative concepts that have advanced her profession. More importantly, Dr. Lehmacher is respected and trusted by her colleagues who view her as someone who can troubleshoot a problem and provide fresh insight or counsel. I know that from experience, as Andrea was an instrumental part of my early career as a new director at Julia Junior College. I am so happy to be able to congratulate Andrea as District 3's Communicator of the Year. Hi everyone, my name is Dr. Andrea Lehmacher and I'm the Director of Marketing at Oakton Community College. Thank you so much for the nomination and award for Communicator of the Year for District 3. I am truly honored, humbled, and beyond grateful. A huge shout out to my Oakton Community College team and family. Thank you for all that you do. Your work does not go unnoticed. And thank you to NCMPR for being a tremendous support and resource to me during my career and a great organization to all of us. As I reflect over my 25 year career in higher education, yes, I feel like I've done great work, but I think about the people I've met along the way. Amazing students, presidents, colleagues, peers, and I have been part of amazing teams. But I am truly blessed to have many of you be called my friend. Thank you for all that you've done for me, the difference that you have made in my life, and the institutions that you choose to serve. The work we do, it is so much bigger than us. It's not about us. It is about impacting students in our communities. I truly believe this because I am a proud community college graduate and that experience has helped shape who I am today. My friends, this has not been an easy year for any of us. It has been a year full of challenges and uncertainties, but I have witnessed amazing innovation, needed crucial conversations, and strong collaborations and partnerships to serve our students, our communities, and our institutions. We are all in this together. It's not about us. Our students matter and community colleges matter. Thank you again for this amazing honor. Congratulations again to Andrea. And now the rising star of the year for District 3 is Lindsay Hocker, Marketing Specialist at Blackhawk College in Illinois. Within six weeks of starting at Blackhawk, Lindsay had developed a blog strategy that focused on student success, personal stories, and the life of a college student. To date, she has written and posted more than 150 blogs featuring students, employees, trustees, and tips for success. Lindsay has taken a leadership role on several project teams involving multiple departments, including one that redesigned the college viewbook, creating a new crisp look that BHC's recruiters love. She also assumed responsibility for marketing and public relations activities at a remote campus 50 miles from the main campus. Tim Wines, Blackhawk College's president, has often expressed his appreciation for Lindsay's approach to her work and outcomes. On short notice, she filmed and edited the college's COVID-19 Congratulations Grads video, on which President Wines provided a voiceover. He praised her professionalism, creativity, and ability to complete the video in time to be part of the college's virtual commencement ceremonies. Congratulations, Lindsay. Hi, I'm Lindsay Hawker. I'm the marketing specialist for Black Hawk College, and I'm so honored to have received the 2020 District 3 Rising Star of the Year Award. I began my professional journey at the University of Iowa, where I studied journalism and nonprofit management. 
At that time, I wasn't sure if I wanted to go into news or marketing after graduating. I ended up working as a local newspaper reporter for several years, covering a variety of topics before I decided to take that news experience and go into marketing. I worked for a nonprofit housing development organization and then for an animal shelter where I did marketing and programming. In 2018, the position at Blackhawk College became available and I was really intrigued and decided to apply for it. During the interview, I was so excited to find out about the storytelling components of the job and also about the college's core values, which really resonated with me. As a reporter, one of my favorite things to do was writing profile stories. So when I found out I was going to be able to tell the stories of our students and alumni, that was really exciting for me. One of my favorite things about this job is that it has brought in components from my past jobs that I've really loved, but it's also allowed me to stretch my creative muscles in new ways. Although I'm a new member, NCMPR has been a big part in helping me grow and learn at this job. Earlier this year, I took the webinar about producing engaging videos during COVID, and it really inspired me. It led to me producing a video about the fall 2020 semester to communicate with students, and it's just changed my thoughts on how to produce videos in general and opened up so many more options. Every single place I've worked, I've really believed in, and Blackhawk College is absolutely no exception. I love how dynamic Blackhawk College is. My first year especially, I was amazed by all the things that we offer to the community. No matter where you are at in life, Blackhawk College has something to offer. I'm so proud to work for a community college and to be an NCMPR member and truly honored to receive this award. Thank you. Congratulations again, Lindsay. The Pace Center of the Year for District 3 is Dr. Marsha J. Ballinger, President of Lorain County Community College in Ohio. As a former member of NCMPR, Dr. Ballinger brings a deep knowledge of marketing and public relations to the President's office. On her first day as President, she wrote her first blog post, Monthly, she continues to address the big issues surrounding community college, education, and societal issues such as racism and the killing of George Floyd. She is the first LCCC president to have an active presence on Twitter, where she has more than 2,000 followers. Dr. Ballinger's focus on student success ignited a shift in campus culture, putting students' needs first. The LCCC campus embraced the responsibilities of a student-ready institution, which resulted in a shift of priorities to meet students where they are. While no one anticipated the 2020 pandemic, Dr. Ballinger's leadership assured LCCC stood ready and able to serve. With the roots of a culture of care firmly in place, the switch to online learning and remote service delivery were readily navigated by LCCC's faculty and staff. Through services like the Commodore Cupboard Food Pantry and Computer Recycling Program, the college pledged that no student would go hungry or without technology. In a career that spans more than 25 years at LCCC, Dr. Ballinger has advanced student success, workforce, and economic development, strategic planning, and institutional advancement. Congratulations, Dr. Ballinger. Hi, I'm Marcia Ballinger, President of Lorain County Community College. I am so honored to accept the NCMPR Paysetter Award for our district, District 3. To receive this award during this time is of such special significance. This is my fourth year as president of LCCC, and by far, it's the most memorable. While no one could have anticipated the rapid changes that we've all experienced, I am so proud that Lorain County Community College is navigating the changes and leading the way through open communications and with a focus on student success and the student experience. To be acknowledged by NCMPR as a paysetter is a milestone, both professionally and personally. I've dedicated my life's work to the mission of community colleges and especially Lorain County Community College. The marketing successes that our teams have achieved throughout the years has been extraordinary, thanks in large part to NCMPR. On a personal note, NCMPR is the organization where it all began for me more than three decades ago. 
I joined NCMPR way back in 1987 when I began my community college career in media relations. It was really my engagement with NCMPR through its conferences and professional development opportunities that I grew as a marketing and PR professional within our community college sector. In the early days of my career, I actually helped to organize the National Conference and the Paragon Awards. And those leadership opportunities helped me to grow into the person who I am today. Throughout my roles at LCCC, I've remained active in NCMPR for many years. And now as president of Lorain County Community College, I wholeheartedly support our marketing and communications team and all the extraordinary work that they do to uplift our college and community, sharing the amazing work that's happening at LCCC and working to put good news out into our world. I'm so fortunate to be able to advocate for community college students and to share their stories. So I am so pleased to accept this wonderful award and I'm truly honored and humbled to represent District 3 as this year's pace setter. Thank you all for what you do to promote our community colleges. Well, that's a wrap on the 2020 District 3 virtual watch party to celebrate the Medallion Awards and Awards of Excellence. Congratulations to all of our winners. You truly deserve it. And in the next coming weeks, we'll be sending you your medallion certificates and gold awards so you can display them prominently in your home office or back on campus when we return. Now, don't forget to submit your entries for the Paragon Awards. The deadline is October 30th. Don't stop the celebrating, keep moving. Let's win some more awards. And don't forget to keep your eyes out for registration details for the virtual conference for 2021. That'll be from March 11th to March 13th. And hopefully we'll be able to be in person for the District 3 conference in 2021 in Grand Rapids. More details on all of that will be coming soon via email. Again, congratulations to all the winners and thanks for joining us. Have a great day.